Hi guys, so today I'm going to share with you guys why I enjoy being an amputee. So one of the main reasons why I enjoy being an amputee is because I, got a lot, I get a lot of recognition now that I am an amputee. Um, when people see me with a prosthetic, right away I get recognized. They're either looking at me sideways or <laughs> looking at me to get to know me. And that right there means a lot to me. Especially because nobody really needs to take the time out of their day to recognize me. So that's one of the main reasons why I enjoy being an amputee. Also, having a prosthetic. Having a prosthetic is pretty cool. Only because I'm able to choose the designs on my socket. I'm able to pick and choose what type of prosthetic I want, what, what I look for in the prosthetic. Having to be able to use my prosthetic for different things, even if it's swimming, riding a bike. I can use it for many reason, many different things, and I feel as though that's pretty cool. Um, also, having children coming up to me and saying how cool it is to have a robot leg, I feel that's pretty cool. I also, as an amputee, I get to decide when I want to wear my leg, when I want to take it off. If, I, if I'm tired, I want to take a break from it, I take a break from it. But if I want to keep wearing it all day, I can, and I think that's pretty dope because when you're tired, you can't take your leg off because it's too heavy, you know? You just have to lay there, rest, and just relax. But me, with the prosthetic, I'm able just to lay down, take it off so I can rest from it. And it's not heavy as, as it normally is. Don't get me wrong, my prosthetic is about 10 to 15 pounds. It's pretty heavy. Like, if you grab my prosthetic, it's pretty heavy. And then overall, being able to do things I've never done before. Being an amputee, before... I was very hesitant to learn how to swim and now I'm very wanting to swim. I want to swim. I want to learn. And before my prosthetic, I was very scared to learn how to swim only because when I was little, I was a little traumatized. When I was little, I almost drowned. So I got very scared to learn how to swim. And now that I don't have my other leg, I feel as though it's pretty cool to learn how to swim. If everybody else can do it, I could do it. I've seen double amputees swim and I'm like, if they could do it, I can definitely do it. So that's one of the main reasons too. I, look, I enjoy being an amputee. I'm able to do things I've never thought I would do. Also becoming a vegetarian is one. I became a vegetarian when I became an amputee. And the only reason why I became a vegetarian is because I wanted to overall help with my health. I wanted a healthier life. I wanted to live longer. I wanted to not get sick that much. It was a lot when it, be, you know, it was a lot for me to become a vegetarian, but I became it. Also getting a pedicure. <laughs> I know it may sound crazy, but before my MVC, I never got a pedicure, never thought to get one, only because I thought people would just stare at me. Um, you know, because I also have lymphedema, so I thought people would just sit there and just stare at me like getting her feet done or something. But now that I'm an amputee, I'm like, man, I don't care. Like, I'm going to go. I'm going to get my um, pedicure. I could care less what people think. I'm just going to go and feel good about myself. Also, being able to inspire many other amputees. I enjoy inspiring everybody else. I never thought to make a YouTube channel until a year ago, and I'm like, you know what, like, I'm gonna do it. Even though it's been hard because I've been depressed some days to upload and there forth, but I know you guys understand me, and that's all that matters. Um, being able to inspire other amputees just just makes me so happy. I never thought, like, I just thought, like, whatever, like, I'm an amputee, and that's that, you know? Being an amputee to me has changed my life for the better. I thought being an amputee was gonna be hard, struggling. Don't get me wrong, I do, but nine times out of 10, like I'm okay, I'm trying. And being an amputee really taught me a lot. It really showed me a lot. It showed me patience, it showed me how to love myself, it showed me confidence, it showed me a lot. And being an amputee really makes me happy because if I wasn't here today, I feel as though it would have been a, a very, a very different life because, you know, my kids wouldn't have me and their forth. But being an, an amputee really, really taught me a lot. It taught me a lot being as a mother, being a, being a fiance, being a housewife. Like, it taught me a lot. And I couldn't think it any better. I'm glad I'm here today as an amputee. And 
being an amputee just makes me happy. I'm able to inspire everybody and that's my, my thing. Also, for airlines, getting priority. When they saw me in a wheelchair when I first went to Dominican Republic in 2018, a year after I got amputated, I went in a wheelchair and I thought I was Miss President or Miss Queen or <laughs> or something. I remember going as an amputee when prosthetic, sitting in a wheelchair. I got service for everything right away. Number one service. I they put me in a fast lane. I was in the front of the line. I felt like the queen. So I would say that's another plus being an amputee. Um, also getting parking at a busy store for instance like the mall any um shopping center when it's very packed i have the handicap placard and i'm able to park in a handicap um parking space and i think that's pretty cool because i really don't have to look for parking i i can just park in the front and just go right into the store i park so close to the store now and i think that's i love that <laughs> I love that being as an amputee. Even though I get looked at, I get stared down, I get talked about, like, why is she parking in the handicap line? Why is she parking there? And I think it's funny because it's just funny. But I remember I had this one incident, and I will not forget. This was probably a few months ago. I was with my fiance. We were outside of Ross, and we parked in a handicap spot. And this guy, it was an old, old elderly man and he was in another car across from me he was in a handicapped spot and i was in a car and i was waiting i was sitting down and he called the police on me well he called the the parking security or whatever you want to call it he called them and they came to my car and they asked why was i a handicap that day? i got a complaint from the guy sitting across from me stating that i should not be in a handicapped parking space and I clearly sat there and I showed him my placard. I said, listen, I am above the knee amputee. I showed him my prosthetic. I said, I am able by law to park in this parking spot. And the guy did not give me a ticket. He understood. And the other guy just looked at me and he just had no words. Like he was speechless. This is why I always say, don't judge a book by its cover. Don't judge anybody who's parking in a handicap. You don't know why they have a handicap placard. They wouldn't be parking there for no reason. Trust me. Being an amputee, I love it. I enjoy it. I'm able to show others what I go through in a daily life. Maybe it's, it's going to help somebody else. Also, seeing other hand amputees out in public, I think it's pretty cool too. And sometimes they don't even know I'm an amputee until... I tell them or if I'm wearing biker shorts or something like that, if it's visible. But I just wanted to share you guys with that, why I enjoy being an amputee. I hope this inspired many others to just be confident just as much as I'm trying to be. Um, again, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Love y'all.